again for Cambodia. And still Cambodia sticking to that man-to-man -man defensive set. So we're not seeing some zone here as we first assumed. Ray Parks somehow we didn't catch it, but somehow pivoted it looked, his way. Looked like a pretty move <laughs> to start with. Tapos na wala lang yung camera. We didn't see the footwork there as the lead is back to 15. Or will come into play in this in the international scene. 95.2% wow. shooting from the line in the UAAP. Un unbelievable astronomical number. You know, he has bailed out Ateneo in a couple of close games in the last two years. Against Adamson, if you remember, mm -hmm. a couple yep. of games against Adamson. Agaw na naman ang Pilipinas. Nangunguna yata tayo dun sa kabila. Sa sobrang bilis po natin, yung camera po hindi nakahabol dito kay Bobby Ray Parks. <laughs> Pero lamang po tayo. Yun po ang importante. 48-27. We're pouring it in now. And uh, they are part of uh, Sinag Pilipinas officially as we see R.R. Garcia convert on this fast break layup. They're there in the, as alternates. Take away, but taken back. Slaughter says no entry. And Ellis fighting hard. Cambodia complaining while the Philippines are running. And Parks misses the gimme. And a conversion underneath para sa Cambodia. I think the primary difference between the first and the second quarter is that the Philippines has locked down on defense much better here in the second period compared to the first quarter. In the first quarter, we saw Cambodia getting those easy opportunities, but not necessarily right now. Yun, one of the players we also highlighted at the top of the telecast. Oh, and a slam by the biggest man in the basketball competitions, Greg Slaughter. Itutulong niya. Uh, being part of the national team. And at the same time, the first thing he told me as, as or about the adjustments going into Coach Norman Black's mm -hmm. system, it's really the defense first mentality uh -huh. of Coach Norman Black as we take a look at that dribble penetration, slick move, and the putback. I think the, 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 the camera work here is assuming that everything is going to be a dunk because there are everything's going to go in a la Pleasantville or or uh, <laughs> parang above the rim lahat ng laro ano pag dahil biglang kakat dun sa taas ng ano backboard eh but this is in trampoline hey, basketball yan naman, eh. <laughs> kung si Greg Slaughter lang lagi pwede a great assist there by Kiefer Ravenna obviously their chemistry showing and this is really their coming out oh, party nice steal by Kiefer Ravenna Ravenna no one to beat with the tip dunk. Another two points for him. So it is now a 75-46 score with 5.30 remaining in the third quarter. And Cambodia, right now, so far, looking outclassed, has been held in the SEA Games. We only lost the gold in 1989 when we bowed down to, at then, the, at that time, the host, yes, Malaysia. Ito na naman. Parang medyo may pagka laro laro na yung dating dito para sa Pilipinas. Ah. Actually won the second season and a bulk of the players will be coming from the Thailand Slammers, that okay. local club. Okay. So sila Ataporn okay. was the MVP in that league. He's coming to represent Thailand as well. So it gets a little tricky. More interesting by Wednesday. Uh, yes, uh, tricky, interesting uh, on Wednesday. And Group B contains teams like Indonesia, Jensila Mario Wuisang, yung point guard nila, Toyi Bisman, their big man. Yeah. And pero ito nga si Jake Pascual. Paminsan minsan, masasabi rin natin, sumasobro naman yung pagka vocal niya, no, sa Sahegas. Another fast break opportunity, really killing time. The work ethic. And I think that's a common denominator for all these players. The work ethic and their willingness to put more into their game and not to, to just settle for what they have. Carvo Lanete knocking down the three-point shot. We see Eric Tipan and Noel Zarate coming up after this game between the Philippines and Cambodia. Great up and under move by Dave Marcelo. That's one facet of his game that he's improved so much, just immensely. He's helping us with, you know, what to look at. Uh, tulung tulung po tayo dito kasi ito ay para sa bayan naman. Uh, Lakas Pinas as the score now is at 110 to 62. And down to the last 40 seconds 
of this game between the Philippines and Cambodia. And you can watch, tell your friends. Siyempre, marami mga nasa opisina, marami nasa kanya-kanyang paralan, eskwela. Sabihin niyo po, ang replay dito po, 9.30 p.m. dito po sa Studio 23. Maya-maya po lamang. Ang Philippine National Women's National Team naman as we continue to pour it on. Now, sharp shooting from beyond the arc. That's Garvo Lanete. Knocking down threes to get it to 127, 60, 68. Yes, Chris, please continue to calculate for me because uh, <laughs> that is not what I'm here for. <laughs> oh, and the cheers. 59-point victory by Sinag Pilipinas. A dominant performance, especially in the second half. That uh -huh. second half much better than the first quarter in particular. So a lot of positives to call from this game by Coach Norman Black. As the two teams now uh, begin to show sportsmanship as they shake hands. Ayan po ang uh, quarter scores and the final score, 127-68. The Philippines shoot 71% from the field and force only a 36% shooting clip on Cambodia. We'll take a break at pag-usapan po natin to. We'll wrap this baby up. Dito po sa Studio 23.